Well, this stands for Musical Instrument Digital Interface, which is better known as MIDI. An expression that has sent waves of terror through many people when it was first encountered. Us included. With development driven on by Roland, it turned into a standard that is accepted worldwide. It isn't that easy to explain briefly for those who might need such an explanation. There are many products available to choose from best MIDI keyboard for Florida Studio, each with different characteristics, benefits, and prices. To help you make a perfect decision I did deep research, read tons of reviews, and compiled a list of the best MIDI keyboard for Florida Studio from reputable brands. After much research, I found these products much helpful for people like you. If you want to know about the price and other information, be sure to check my description. So without any further delay let's jump into the video. Number 1. The Kai Professional MPK MIDI MKII. At one time, Akai was one of the biggest players in creative sound. The Akai and its follow-up the 4000DS were excellent 4-track recorders and were many people's first introduction to recording at home. Unfortunately, they ceased trading in 2002. Maybe it was complacency, but they did get knocked back by other Japanese companies that took hold of the marketplace. Today they are marketed by independents who have ensured the famous name lives on. The MPK Mini MKII is a neat little unit designed for the home music producer. But given its size of 7.13 by 12.52 by 1.73 inches and weighing just over 1 pound, it is great for traveling with. It has just 25 velocity sensitive keys and a 4-way controller for modulation and pitch control. The top panel is completed by two banks of backlit MPC-like pads and 8 Q-Link controls, which can be assigned. The keyboard might only have 25 keys, but with the built-in octave down and up controls, you get the full range of a piano. There is also an input for a sustained pedal to add some more expression. However, the pedal is not included. You get an arpeggiator that has adjustments for range and resolution, allowing you to create complex arrangements. Also, access to any of Akai's MPC, Music Production Center, Workstation Technologies. The comprehensive package of production software is included. This includes virtual instruments. Also, Hybrid 3 and Sonivox synthesizers. They all come with plenty of controls, editing, and filtering facilities. The MPK Mini MKII doesn't need drivers to be downloaded or external power. It gets its power through a USB connection to a computer. Furthermore, it is both Mac and Windows compatible. All in all, it is very much a plug-in and play instrument. Compact, portable, and easy to use at a very attractive price. Plenty of built-in sound feature. Number 2. Alice's Best Compact MIDI Keyboard. Next, in our search for the best MIDI keyboard for Florida Studio, if you prefer a larger keyboard to work with, this will be of interest. The keys are also full size, so you get the feeling and the expression of playing on a real keyboard. Having said that, it is still a compact unit measuring 9.60 by 37.60 by 4.53 inches. It weighs just over 6 pounds. There are 49 keys designed with square fronts to create an authentic feel. The keys are not weighted, which some may not like. There are 8 touch bits with backlit LEDs. The pads are velocity and pressure sensitive. There are 4 control knobs and 4 push buttons, all of which can be assigned different functions. You will also find modulation and pitch wheels, as well as just about everything you need for some serious sound shaping. And the blue LEDs that light up the knobs, buttons, and pads make it easy to use in darkened rooms. Despite having 49 keys, it also has an octave shifter, which allows access to a full range of the 88 keys you would find on a concert grand piano. Data connection and power are supplied through one USB cable. Plugins and a variety of virtual instruments can be controlled by the V49. It is worth noting that it appears that this keyboard is not compatible with macOS Catalina 10.15. There does not seem to have been an update from Alice's. We think if you use that OS on your Mac, it is worth checking first. A good keyboard controller set at an attractive price point. It is especially suitable for use with Florida versions 9 and higher. Plenty of good features built in. 49 keys and backlight controls, buttons, and knobs. Number 3. Quark 25 Key MIDI Controller. If you need a MIDI controller, but you are on a tight budget, then you have just found the answer. This controller from Quark is a great little unit. And of course, when we are talking about electronic music creation, there aren't many bigger names than Korg. Founded in 1962 in Japan, they have been responsible for some of the sounds we hear every day on tracks recorded by some of the world's best. This might be a budget price controller, but it is still full of great Korg creativity. Measuring just 14.60 by 1.60 by 3.70 inches and weighing under 1 pound, it is a versatile controller. It will work happily either in a studio environment or at home on your laptop. You can even connect up your smartphone or tablet. It is also easy to carry around with you if necessary. This is a 25 key model with velocity sensitive keys that are very touch responsive. As it is not over endowed with too many features, it is easy to use. Setup is quick and painless, and you will be making music in a few minutes. If you use Logic or GarageBand, there is a driver that needs to be installed. 
There are no recorded issues with the download. It is powered using a USB connection to your laptop or desktop. Number 4. Novation Launchpad Ableton Live Controller. Novation is quite a well-known brand in certain circles. They're part of a group of brands that includes Ficuzrite, who most will be familiar with. This is another MIDI controller that integrates with a DAW. In this case, that is Ableton Live Lite. If you are already using Ableton, then it does need to be version 9.2 or later. If not, there will be compatibility issues. Once you acquire Launchpad, setting it up is easy. There are 64 pads that illuminate, so you can see exactly what you are doing. These make the operation easy to understand. And they are a big plus if you are using the controller on a stage in dark lighting. There are plenty of instruments and options built in. Furthermore, you can use the grid to create drum tracks. Connections make it easy to utilize Ableton's drum tracks, as well as other loops and samples. It is a compact unit measuring just 9.45 by 9.45 by 0.98 inches, and is therefore easy to carry around. This makes it suitable not only for home studio work, but also for live performances. There will be a learning curve attached to this controller. This is especially relevant if you are new to Ableton. However, while this is designed with Ableton in mind, it will work with a variety of other DAWs. It is compatible with Mac OS 10.9 and higher and Windows 8 and higher. Operated via easy to read colored pads. Plenty of Ableton loops and samples included at a decent price point. Number 5. The Kai Fire Professional Performance Controller. If you are looking for a MIDI instrument to work with Florida Studio, then you can't beat a product designed in conjunction with ImageLine. This makes it a strong candidate for being the best MIDI keyboard for Florida Studio. As it is made by Kai, that is another good reason. It certainly has a certain style about it, and anyone looking for a conventional keyboard MIDI controller won't find it here. It measures 12.44 by 6.52 by only 0.9 of an inch, and, therefore, has a small footprint. There is a 16 by 4 matrix sporting backlit RGB pads. RGB being the red, green, and blue theory of color recognition of humans. The pad sizes can be altered to suit the size you want. Whilst it is small and lightweight at under 2 pounds, we recommend that this is used in a secure place. It probably won't take too kindly to be dropped. They are what you might call complex to any MIDI newbies. Likewise, there will be a learning curve involved. The programming is based around a step sequencer process. This is achieved using the pads which are velocity sensitive. Tracks and sounds are built in this way. There are plenty of toolbar and playlist menus. Additionally, you can that's all from my end. I make helpful videos daily so do subscribe my channel. If you need more information or if you want to know product price do check out my description. For any kind of problem please comment below. Stay updated with our cool products as it will make your life much more easy.